Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and um, of course we're talking about the notepad on this uh, because a lot of you have been going a little crazy over the fact that uh, Microsoft wanted to send the notepad and, and have it come from the Microsoft Store as an app rather than um, you know having it kind of integrated already like it always been in uh, Windows. So for a long time they were talking about the um, notepad and 20H1, the next version of Windows, would actually be in uh, in the store. So you would have to go to the store to get that and uh, download the notepad and so on. And, you know, not everybody was happy. And honestly, honestly, you know, in all fairness, notepad, why do you want to do a remove their original notepad, replace it with an app from the store for the notepad. It's fine like it is. People that use a notepad, honestly, they aren't looking for a lot of power and they're just, you know, looking for a way to either write a little text or, or paste text for something. And that's it. And I, I just, you know, I'm, I'm okay with the fact that, okay, if you want to make a uh, Microsoft store version of it, fine, but don't remove the original. But now, I guess maybe the controversy kind of caught up with them a little bit. Or somebody somewhere said, come on, guys, what are you doing? And so the uh, we know that the notepad, the Microsoft Store notepad, is now something gone. They removed it from the Microsoft Store. And uh, from what we know, they have no intention of bringing it back. So uh, long live notepad. So for those of you that were like, yeah, really? Come on. Um, well, don't be afraid. Notepad is there to stay, apparently. So unless they change their mind at some point, once again, Microsoft does that, you know, from time to time. But honestly, Notepad, come on. You know, uh, there was a uh, actually a, a very, um, I think it's Mary Jo Foley that, that said it right. She said, you know, if you want to make something else, it's all right. But when you have something that works and that's there and that people use, why change it? if it is just perfect the way it is and the way that it's actually integrated into Windows. I mean, Notepad has been there for, I think Notepad existed in Windows 3.1. You know, it's one of those things that's been there forever. So, uh, you know, uh, it's okay if you want to make another one, but don't touch the original one. That I mean, it's that little thing. Notepad is that thing that it's there and we all use it at some point for something because it's there and it's easy to access, you know, but uh, I don't know. Sometimes there are these things where Microsoft doesn't know what it's doing, I think. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thanks for watching.